you mentioned eligibility. Uh, players have now been told they can have the extra year of eligibility because of COVID-19. Oh, nice take mm -hmm. by Smith. 67 and shot 42% as a team to keep the record clean at 4-0. That one bounces around the rim. They'll go for three and hit it. Smith knocking down the three-pointer. will bounce off of the backboard and Van Lith trying to get the numerical advantage. Step back, and that's a three. Right near the line and good for Kiana Smith. Trying to knife her way through the Duke defenses. And the turnaround over the front rim from Smith with the soft touch. And now Smith to bring it up on the dribble, take it herself and lay it in. Somebody left their spot. Tough shot. Yeah, Good defense. It was indeed. Kiana Smith was right in her face. Nice lead pass. Lead in 4-11 and trying to run and jump out of it, as you can see. Good ball movement is the key. And a nice job inside with the left hand by Kiana Smith. She is so solid in so many ways. Didn't get frustrated yesterday. There's a nice feed again inside. Someone that has uh, come along, worked very hard in the gym, and she always seems to have a very quiet game. Doesn't show a lot of emotions on the floor as that shot is hit by Kiana Smith. And you can see how she moves, how athletic she is, 6'2", her length. And, you know, just has a very, very high ceiling even in, in terms of where she will go. She's brought that average well up. She is six for six from three. It was only 33% coming into today, which is pretty good, but still down from where it was last year. Is the best in the ACC. Louisville trying to establish inside position, and they get the bucket as they go inside, and that's Cochran. Couldn't calculate the angle. Back the other way. Here comes Louisville and Balagoon. Smith thought about the three, got closer to the bucket, and hit the shot to get games in because of COVID. They were not supposed to be playing Clemson today, for instance. Outside shot is nailed by Kiana Smith. Monique shuffled her feet. And Cochran actually has checked into the ball game for Louisville. In a bit of a dog fright right now with Clemson. Spray got it blocked. And now Louisville on the run, and a good way for Kiana Smith in the starting lineup for Jeff Walls all year. And that's a throwaway right into the hands of Mikasa Robinson. Dana Evans, who has two fouls, did not start the second quarter. And has also improved her free throw shooting, so just her overall touch is much better this year. 85% from the line this year, which is tremendous destiny. Town has got rejected. Kiana Smith doing everything. Thomas looks to get to the rim, uh-uh, says Kiana Smith. Nothing has gotten by her. Does a nice job of body control. Clemson in a zone defense here. Oh, what, what a pass beautiful. from Kiana Smith. Wow. I mean, look at those arms. And not to say that she's that caliber of a player, but just in terms of how she looks on the court. And this is one of the dangerous things about Louisville when they defensive rebound, they don't need to make the outlet unless Cochran gets it. And then they quickly get into their offense. And see, here's the thing. This is where Dana Evans is so good. Shot up and good by Smith. Smith gets her own rebound and the Dixon inside for two more. You should, and you, most coaches are working on these inside their system in October. Eight on the shot clock. Paint so far tonight that's helped them to a 14 point lead over Boston College. Absolutely secured after the Evans miss. That pass taken by Smith. 
The flick ahead to Van Lith who will lay it in. Up. She's had a nice stretch, hasn't she, the last three possessions. All the way to the rack, mid-range, and then the three. Nine points for Jackson as Smith answers. Jackson has been a real bright spot this afternoon. She's been good in transition, and she's been really good off of uh, ball screening action as well. Well, Kiana Smith just has a smoothness and yeah. control to her game. Bono gets it over to Evans. Kiana Smith hits the bottom of the net. 44 to 36, they've hit seven threes. Kiana Smith from Dana for one of them. Cardinals shot 57% in the first half, both overall and from three. Kiana Smith knocks one down as well. The last three ATOs. Ooh, I thought one. that was travel. 23 for Holoshinska. Four on the shot clock for Kiana Smith, and she gets the bucket. Here's Kiana Smith, the transfer from Cal, gotten off to a very strong start to her Louisville campaign. Nice find there, and Van Lith lays it in. On the way Louisville plays defense, but you're going to have to be able to make shots. Smith knocks down her three on this end. Long arms of Kiana Smith took that ball away. He's defending one pass away, and this is exactly what Kiana Smith is doing in this possession as well. One pass away, Jen, you know, they played without her last year when she was with the Nigerian national team, and they lost both those games. So they're playing with her again today. I expected to see some zone out of them. I'm looking for Louisville right here to pick up their pace defensively and get more aggressive with that high-risk, high-reward defense, which results in a first possession turnover and bucket. Might want to add, too, Georgia Tech leads the ACC in defense. Little runner with the left hand and got the friendly bounce. It is a stark number when you look at it and in the category the women don't want to be winning in but are and that's the canceled postponed games. You've got to be flexible if you're going to make it through this season. Eden, you name it, but Italy, Italy Spain. Spain. Oh, another little dribble drive. And Georgia Tech almost got it back, but Cardinals able to retain possession. I think Van Lith is going to have some unbelievable numbers by the time she's done. Who just became eligible after the holidays. And they are having their way as Louisville in the lane. Harrison just slipped, so it actually will go back to Louisville. And Kiana Smith steals the two. Setting a couple of screens here for Lewis, trying to get away from Evans. Well, they're trying to isolate Engsler inside. Good D by Smith, good read, good ball pressure. Kiana with the pick, Robinson with the and one. Turnover results in buckets for Louisville. Costa Robinson couldn't even see the rim. Uh, with Alana Smith with the spin, and got it up and over Kunain. Roger gets it into Kunain, immediately faces up and gets stripped from behind. Smith running with Evans. Dana leaks out behind the line, finds a driving lane and the window. Thinks she's got the advantage, tough shot, good defense by Dixon. Here comes Evans, three on two. Smith running the floor, and one for Louisville. First half I talked about, you cannot have back-to-back -back mistakes in a championship game, and this is why. You give the other team momentum, two runouts, two layups for Louisville.